Hi guys, so in the last tutorial of linked list series, we talked about how to find cycle in singly linked list. Now in this tutorial, we're going to talk about how to remove cycle from singly linked list. So let's get started. Now, as you can see, we have already created one list with some dummy data nodes. And you, if you observe this list, it is framing a chain or cycle of nodes, right? From node 40 onwards. So if you print these nodes, so it will keep printing these nodes again and again until stack will not overflow because of this chain, right? Because the last node of this list is pointing back to the previous node. So as a part of this tutorial, we have to break this link, which is pointing back to the node again, right? So when we break this link between 40 and 80, so it will point to null and it will looks like this. See now, uh, the link between 40 and 80 is, uh, is no longer available and it is pointing to null. Now, if you print this list, it will print the node from 10 to 80, right? It will not um, print again and again this list. So uh, this is what we have to done using backend code. Now we're going to use the existing code, which we have written in the our previous tutorial. Uh, so we're going to use that code and also we, we will be writing some more logic, which, which will help us to remove the link between, uh, basically link, which is creating a cycle. We have to remove that. That is the extra work, which we have to done as a part of this tutorial. So let's get started now. So here you can see we have, um, we have developed this, this logic in our previous tutorial. So I hope you guys are aware of what is the use of these uh, pointers, right? Fast pointer, slow pointer. Be uh, if you are not, please have a look into that tutorial because I have explained each and every line of uh, this logic. So um, now after finding the uh, loop, I mean, if the loop is exist, so after this while loop, what we're gonna do here is, we're gonna check, right? Whether is loop exist, then only we're gonna um, write the logic for removing cycle from the singly linked list. Now let's create. Uh, so here you can see, right? Uh, our slow and fast pointer is pointing to node 60, right? So what we have to do here is we have to reset this uh, slow pointer so that it will start pointing to head again. So why I'm doing this because uh, when it will start iterating from head, so it will uh, keep going forward, right? So it will meet to the first, uh, I mean, first node, which is a causing of, uh, which is causing of this uh, cycle. So it will meet here itself, right? So that's why we have to re reset a uh, slow pointer uh, to head so that it will start iterating from here and wherever our uh, uh, fast pointer, it will keep going. So it will me meet to first uh, node of cycle, which is this. So from here itself, uh, we're gonna uh, break this link between here and here. So we're gonna use one another extra variable, which will be keeping the uh, record of previous, uh, previous node, right? So let's reset this first it will start pointing wherever head is pointing. So head is pointing to first node of this list. So let's make this. So first we have to reset the <coughs> slow pointer. So slow will be start pointing to head, which we have done here, right? So it start pointing to head. Now next work is we have to create a uh, one node, which will be keep tracking the record of uh, this fast pointer. So before moving fast pointer, we will be uh, assigning, we'll be keeping the record of uh, fast pointer into new uh, pointer, which is previous. Okay. Initially the previous value will be null. <coughs> or we can assign here fast. Okay now okay let's let's create this variable here this will be a 
right now as we assign to as we assign fast to previous so previous will start pointing to here <coughs> this previous right now um, <coughs> we will be iterating these um, list so we'll do slow if it is not equal to fast then we will be keep iterating this so uh, now if it is not equal so we have to write some um, statements of while loop so that we will be able to move our pointers one step forward on each iteration so before moving fast pointer one step forward we're gonna keep the reference of fast pointer will be pre preserving the reference of past pointer into previous let's do that first then let's move a uh, slow pointer one step forward slow dot get next same will be doing for fast as well fast is equal to fast dot get next i'll explain you what is the use of these uh, this previous and why this time we are not um, moving fast pointer two step forward why we are moving fast step only one step forward so okay we have move uh, fast one step forward slow one step forward and we are preserving the fast into previous right so uh, when we preserve this node so what we're going to do here is from here itself right let's uh, discuss this now so when loop exists right when your uh, this pointer will start pointing to when this it was pointing earlier to 60 right here now what we have done here we have moved our slow pointer back to wherever had this pointing okay now next part is we have created previous and it will start pointing to fast so it is start pointing to fast now we will we will be checking whether slow and fast is not equal the slow is 10 and fast is 60 so it's not equal this condition is true we're gonna assign previous to fast sorry fast to previous so fast is already pointing to previous right now we're gonna move slow pointer one step forward and fast pointer one step forward so let's move slow pointer one step forward and fast pointer also one step forward right <coughs> uh, now again it will check whether slow and fast is not equal slow is 20 and fast is 70 right it's not equal so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna uh, assign fast to previous so fast is sorry huh we're gonna assign fast to previous means previous will start pointing to fast right now the next point is we're gonna move slow pointer one step forward and fast pointer one step forward so let's move slow pointer one step forward and also fast step one step forward fast pointer is pointing to 80 and slow pointer is pointing to 30 now we're gonna again check whether slow is not equal to fast so slow is 30 and fast pointer is 80 so it's not equal this condition is true this while condition is true it will come inside this while loop and we're gonna assign fast pointer to previous again so previous will start pointing to wherever fast point fast pointer is pointing so this line is done now next is we're gonna move uh, slow and fast pointer one step forward okay so it will start pointing to 40 and fast pointer will start pointing to 40 right now up to here it's done right now in next iteration we we're gonna check whether slow and fast is not equal so slow is pointing to 40 and fast is pointing to 40 means it reach here right now there is no any chance to uh, go back to 80 node I mean previous node and um, reset this link right so for that we have created this uh, this previous 
right now you can see previous is pointing to 80 right now we have reference <coughs> we, we have reference of last node which is pointing to the first node which is a creating of cycle I mean first node of cycle is 40 so both previous and sorry both fast fast pointer as well as slow pointer is pointing to 40 right here but uh, we have created uh, one another pointer which is previous so uh, it is preserving the reference of previous node so right now it is pointing to here because from here itself we're gonna reset the link or reference of uh, this node it will start pointing to uh, null that's why uh, we have created this previous node previous pointer so I hope you guys are aware of now what is the use of this previous right and why we are moving slow and uh, fast pointer one step forward on some position um, these both pointer will point to the same node and that node will be uh, first node of cycle right now when we found um, first node of cycle and previous is pointing to the uh, last node which is again connecting to the first node of cycle so here itself what we have to do uh, we have to reinitialize this uh, reference of last node to null so let's do that previous dot set next to null right now the link between 40 and 80 will break and it will point to null like this okay so uh, here right we gonna print this now we're gonna print um, the list right so right now let's print without um, cycle so it will keep uh, iterating this loop because there is a cycle right so let's comment this out to check whether it is keep printing or not we just need to verify once okay null okay there is no any cycle that's why it is printing um, this it's printing false because there is no any cycle so let's uncomment this let's run this now now you can see it's keep printing right it is keep printing this list means this cycle is keep going let me forcefully stop this right see this it is keep printing this list 50 60 70 80 again from 80 again it is printing 40 50 60 70 and 80 and again it is printing 40 50 60 70 80 right so it is keep printing these nodes this cycle again and again this cycle right 40 50 60 70 80 and again 40 50 60 70 80 so let's uncomment our code and verify now <coughs> so this is logic which we have uh, done now right so now let's not create cycle first let's test without cycle you can see right 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 and 80 right and uh, is loop existing linkly uh, singly linked list it is returning false let's create a cycle so 8 eighth node is pointing back to fourth node like this eighth this is the last eighth node and it is pointing back to fourth node so it is keep it is creating a cycle right but after uh, this logic it will break the cycle right so this is what we are trying to do let's run this and verify yeah so it is saying loop is exist it's true but we have uh, we have break the link between uh, I mean which is the causing of cycle we have break that link right so before that that also if we want to print this list okay let's uncomment this again 
to verify you guys whether the same code is working or not it will keep printing this list again and again right you can see it oh guys see it's keep printing this list right so let me forcefully stop this program yeah now i can show you see it is keep printing this list again and again and again right so our logic is working fine just that i i have done this commenting and commenting this part so that you guys have better idea okay i'm not able to uncomment this okay so let's run this we have already ver verified whether that it was uh, key printing but now when we uncomment this uh, removing cycle from list logic see it is not key printing the list again and again because we have uh, we have this we have break this link between nodes right which was causing the cycle now it is working fine see so this is this is saying that uh, cycle is exist and after removing the cycle we have these nodes right so the last node which was pointing back to 40 now it's pointing to null like this so we have done with this video guys thank you so much for watching this video and stay tuned for another videos thank you